ladies, gentlemen, let the show begin. All right, do you like video games? And I know you do. What about entertainment? We got that to video game. I'm on a video game. Video game. Oh, what's the name? Video game Armada. Time for another edition of the Games and Gear of E3 2017. And of course, this is the one true gamer, Boss Bronze. You know, people, Xenoblade. That's a popular thing. And even though back in the day it was fun to poo poo on Nintendo, they are making a comeback thanks to the Switch. But it truly began with Xenoblade Chronicles. Now, I'll be honest with you, never played. Uh, even even as we you and we centric as my play uh, my play style was when they were the consoles to get from Nintendo, I've really never even heard of it. Shoot, if it wasn't for the fact that uh, what's his face, um, that guy with the super cool looking sword showed up. Shulk, that's his name, Shulk. That is a very odd name for a main character, but what what do I know? Never played it, never heard of it, didn't even see a commercial, so it went right under the radar until I saw Shulk and wanted the Smash Brothers, and it garnered some interest. So I did some research and I found out that this game is a, an amazing game that has plenty more than a fair amount of fans, so... Well, should I play it? No, I chose not to. Why? Because at the time, Xenoblade Chronicle X was a thing. And I said, I decided, shoot, I am going to play that and have a good time. And you know what, people? I did play it. It had all the anime goodness, plus mechs, plus big guns, and a very epic and very crazy story, but I loved it anyway. The only problem is, didn't finish it. Oh. No, no, didn't finish it. Why? I don't know. I don't know. Things came up, and other games came up, and before you know it, I sold it, so I have more money for more games. I know it's a problem. It's a habit. I'm working on it. Uh, but the point is, never finished it, and I never played the original. And here's another secret about me. Uh, I actually knew about the Xeno series right when it was still Xeno Gears. Yeah, people out there, do you guys know Xeno Gears? If you do, that's amazing. But if you don't, I don't blame you. It was the first of the Xeno Saga games back in the old PlayStation era, and I've been playing it since then. Did I finish Xeno Gears? No, I did not. It's really sad. I, the Xeno series, they are a good series. Have I finished one? No. This my friends, is my redemption. Because the very first game they highlighted in the Nintendo press conference for E3 this year was Xenoblade Chronicles 2, where it features a new cast of characters, but in a similar situation as the first game, more or less, meaning mechanized giant things and almost pseudoscience situations where a hero's gotta discover himself and the power he holds inside. Xenoblade Chronicles 2 is exactly the same thing, except different and not the same characters. What's my point? Why highlight this? Well, most of the Xeno series games are good. So this one, Xenoblade Chronicles 2, is gonna be good. But, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to get this game. You should too, because it's gonna be good, and you know it and I'm going to play this game, and I am going to finish this game. I swear that all that is gaming, this game will not escape my grasp. I will dedicate myself long and hard to play it, and I should beat it. I will not have this conversation with you people again about me not playing this game. I feel bad. As the Omni Gamer, no game should escape my grasp without being conquered, but time and time again, if it has Xeno in it, it has escaped and or eluded me. Not for this title. Not for Xenoblade Chronicles 2. No. No, 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 no. And for people who have a Switch, this is going to be an awesome RPG to play as well. 
I enjoyed the combat system. It sort of harkens back to the old classic turn-based style, but it's still got a lot of action-oriented stuff, so you can't just sit on your thumbs and do nothing. Also, you get to explore a giant beast called Titans, which, it's so huge, people live on them! So beat that Monster Hunter f- <laughs> No, 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 I, I can't, I can't. But also, the weapons are also living, which are amazing, and sentient android robots, I think. I'm not sure. This, the details of Xenoblade Chronicles 2 is a little sparse, but I do know that it will be an amazing game, colorful, but still serious where it counts. Watch the trailer, or watch the trailer I'm providing right now to see one for yourself. You should pick it up, especially if you have a Switch. There's... why the heck not? Me, I'm definitely going to pick it up just for my own personal pride, because never again. And this is the One Drama Gamer Boss Bronze telling you to, once again, stay tuned for the next Game and Gear list item of E3 2017. Till then, though, take care.